2018 Ford Fusion Review The 2018 Ford Fusion hasn't changed dramatically over the last few years, that is certainly a good thing. The Fusion was in a highly competitive class of mid-size sedans, nevertheless it continues to impress us having its comfortable interior, user-friendly tech and great driving dynamics. The 2018 Fusion would be also lost with this class if this weren't due to its high-quality interior and abundant available safety equipment. Available items including adaptive cruise control, a computerized parking system and forward collision mitigations will want to appeal towards the safety conscious, while SYNC 3's excellent controls should match the tech crowd. The Fusion incorporates a few flaws but many of them are associated with base versions on the car and in addition they can be managed via a few upgrades. For instance, the bottom 2.5-litre engine has no much power, but three available alternatives offer improved performance. So as the 2018 Ford Fusion may look relatively similar externally to Fusions from years past, the entire contents of this mid-size sedan is continually updated to guarantee that it remains a premier competitor in side class. Notably, we pick the 2018 Ford Fusion as one of best AWD sedans, best mid-size sedans along with the 2018 Ford Fusion Sport as one on the best sport sedans because of this year. What's new? The 2018 Ford Fusion carries over unchanged. The 2018 Ford Fusion gives a wide range of trim levels and features, but we feel the Fusion say with one in the optional engine upgrades is an effective start for almost all buyers. The optional 1.5-liter engine comes with a slight boost in power over the common 2.5-liter engine in addition to improved mileage. For even more punch, there is the optional 2.0-liter engine, which can be also paired with all-wheel drive. One additional option looking at is the technology package with SYNC 3. It offers you Ford's latest, most user-friendly technology interface that has numerous useful features. Trim levels and features. The 2018 Ford Fusion is really a Ford or 5-passenger mid-size sedan obtainable in 5 trim levels, S, say, Titanium, Platinum and V6 Sport. The hybrid and plug-in hybrid referred to as the Fusion Energy are reviewed separately. The base trim levels S and say in the Fusion have a great amount of standard equipment including features like Bluetooth connectivity, power front seats and satellite radio. On upper trim levels, there is a long list of available comfort and convenience features like ventilated seats, adaptive cruise control and premium sound systems. The base Fusion S comes standard while using 2.5-litre four-cylinder engine 175 horsepower, 175 lbft, front-wheel drive, a six-speed automatic transmission, 16-inch alloy wheels, automatic headlights, LED taillights a rear view camera, cruise control, air conditioning, a tilt handless coping tire, cloth upholstery, a height adjustable driver seat, 6040 split folding rear seats, audio and call voice commands sync, Bluetooth connectivity, smartphone app integration along with a 4 speaker subwoofer with a 4.2 inch center screen, a CD player, an auxiliary audio jack plus a USB port. For some more creature comforts, the Fusion Say adds 17-inch wheels, LED daytime running lights, exterior keypad entry, an 8-way power driver seat with power lumbar, a 6-way power passenger seat, rear heat ducts, a rear center fold-down armrest as well as a 6-speaker speakers with satellite radio. Optional to the S and Say could be the appearance package, which features 18-inch alloy wheels, fog lights, a rear spoiler, a leather wrap tire and special cloth upholstery. The say can be available while using luxury package equipment group 202A, which adds the turbocharged 1.5 litre engine 181 horsepower, 185 lbft with automatic engine stop start to help save fuel, 
LED headlights and fog lights, keyless ignition and entry, remote ignition, an auto dimming rear view mirror and driver side mirror, heated mirrors, leather upholstery, driver seat memory settings and heated front seats. Opting for the Tsei's technology package equips the Fusion with rear parking sensors, dual zone automatic climate control, and 11 speaker speakers, the SYNC 3 technology interface having an 8-inch central LCD touchscreen and two configurable gauge cluster displays, enhanced voice controls plus an additional USB charging port. The Fusion Titanium gets all on the Tsei's optional features, but it comes standard together with a turbocharged 2.0-litre engine 240 horsepower, 270 lbft, 18-inch wheels, LED taillights, a rear spoiler, ambient interior lighting, sport front seats, 8-way power adjustment with a passenger seat, reduced 12-speaker Sony subwoofer and HD radio. The Fusion say together with the technology package selected and titanium can be equipped which has a navigation system, a mechanical parking system for parallel and perpendicular parking, and adaptive cruise control with frontal collision warning and stop and go traffic capability. For the say and titanium, Ford additionally affords the driver assist package, consisting of automatic high beam control, automatic wipers, a 110 volt power outlet, a heated tire, blind spot monitoring, rear cross traffic alert, along with a lane departure warning and land keeping assist system. A sunroof is optional for both the say and titanium, and also the titanium might be hood with 19 inch wheels and ventilated front seats. The borderline luxury level platinum trim includes all from the above features and a unique grill insert, upgraded leather trim as well as a power adjustable leader. If you are looking for a sporty version in the Fusion that still has some top-end features, the V6 Sport depends on features through the say with all the luxury package and adds a turbocharged V6 engine 325 horsepower, 380 lbft, all-wheel drive, another grille, 19-inch wheels, cod exhaust tips, a rear spoiler, adjustable suspension dampers, leather and simulated suede upholstery, and also in nine speaker speakers. The V6 Sport Upgrade Package Equipment Group 401A is around as high up as you're able go in the Fusion, also it includes most in the features in the titanium trim. It can be available together with the driver assist package plus the standalone options as listed above. Trim Tested Each vehicle typically will come in multiple versions which are fundamentally similar. The S within this review provide our full test in the 2017 Ford Fusion Say EcoBoost Turbo 1.5 liters in line 4, 6 speed automatic, FWD. Steering The Fusion steering is nicely weighted, and it also returns to center willingly. Though low speed parking can be a breeze, fears little feeling of link with the road from the steering during spirited driving. Handling Despite the steering's not enough driver to road connection, the Fusion handles and maneuvers rather effectively. The chassis feels solid, the suspension minimizes body roll, also it isn't upset whether it encounters a bump mid-corner, so curvy mountain roads pose little drama. Drivability The Fusion happens short in certain performance areas, but overall it is really an enjoyable car they are driving. In the city it's simple to maneuver, also it has excellent brake responsiveness. The standard 6-speed automatic transmission shifts smoothly but leisurely. Comfort Though the Fusion has some minor problems with comfort, they are not too difficult to forgive. The ride is often smooth traveling, road noise is kept low, along with the front seats certainly are a particularly nice destination for a sit even for hours and hours. Seat Comfort The standard cloth seats are nicely padded and gives a great balance of support and comfort that takes hours. But we found it harder to become comfortable from the optional leather seats, which feel taut and stiffer. Nice adjustable front headrests, 
outboard rear seats are set with a pleasant angle. Ride comfort. The Fusion feels planted in the majority of scenarios, and yes it isn't upset by most small imperfections from the road. Out while traveling, the ride senses a bit floaty without passengers or cargo, however it's not bouncy or uncontrolled. Noise and vibration. The 1.5 liter engine rumbles a bit under full acceleration, but otherwise the cabin is fairly quiet, especially while traveling. A minor volume of wind and road noise gets into the cabin. Climate control. Automatic climate control isn't standard, nonetheless it did connect our mid-level say test car. The system performed adequately in warm weather, though the climate control buttons are smaller than average laid out in a very somewhat unconventional way. It takes serious amounts of learn the system. Interior. Almost everyone should chose the Fusion's interior pleasant and accommodating. It's easy to get involved and away from, the driving position is nicely adjustable, and also the cabin provides a good volume of space. Tall passengers usually takes issue using the sloping rear roof line when stepping into the back seat. Ease people. The cabin carries a rotary transmission shifter that can take some getting used to. But most cabin controls are nicely grouped and to operate in a glance, though a few on the buttons take the small side. Steering wheel buttons ensure it is easy to sort throughout the comprehensive dashboard screen. Getting and jetting out. Most occupants will discover it very easy to climb in and out with a fusion on account of wide opening doors, generous door openings and seats that happen to be set with an inviting height. The only exception could be the sloping rear roof line, which can prompt those over 6 feet in height to duck since they slide into your back seat. Driving position. Driving posture is comfortable and watchily adjustable. Tilt and list coping wheel features a generous adjustment range. Cloth and leather seats both offer height adjustments. But all drivers ought to know that the 10-way power mechanism doesn't let the leather seats to travel as far down since the cloth ones. Roominess. The Fusion feels spacious, and its particular front and rear seats provide above the average amounts of head, leg and hip room. Rear headroom is impacted somewhat through the sloping rear roof line, but only those over 6 feet. Tall should notice. The optional sunroof is a bite from headroom. Visibility. Outward visibility is great despite fairly thick windshield pillars, even so the rear blind spot is bigger average because of broad rear roof pillar as well as a smaller than average rear quarter window. A rear view camera is standard, and parking sensors are optional, that's typical in this particular segment. Quality. No significant squeaks or rattles, but several panels inside and exterior were slightly misaligned on our test car. The quality of materials is acceptable to the price, however the higher trim levels can serve the Fusion feel less such as a rental. Utility A large trunk and many cabin storage for small items make Fusion perfect for storing plenty of your stuff each other and every day or for family trips. Small item storage. Storage spaces will include a large bin in the front armrest as well as a spacious tray beneath the center console. Both front and back center armrests have two cup holders, plus there is one in each in the wide door pockets. None will hold anything bigger than an average size water bottle or even a coffee cup. Cargo space. A wide trunk opening using a low lift over height and standard 6040 split folding rear seats supply you with easy access to your Fusion's substantial trunk. With 16 cubic feet of volume and side trunk alone, the Fusion has more cargo space compared to the Accord, Camry, Malibu and Mazda 6. Technology with the revolutionary Sync 3 infotainment system as well as the advent of Apple CarPlay and Android Auto, 
The Ford Fusion is one with the more approachable and tech-friendly vehicles available on the market. It's simple to connect devices, execute voice commands or navigate to some destination and not using a steep learning curve. Audio Navigation Sync 3 and its particular onboard navigation are a lot easier better versus the old My Ford Touch system. Like a smartphone, Sync 3 has big virtual buttons plus the ability to swipe through menus. Satellite radio signal was often dropped, though, likely because of weak antenna, and high volume audio quality isn't great. Smartphone integration All fusions with Sync 3 have Apple CarPlay and Android Auto functionality along with a second USB port. If you don't utilize techniques, it is possible to still pair your phone via Bluetooth, which is really a nice option to get. Voice Control As always, Ford's voice controls, now via Sync 3, are wonderful. Natural language and commands do wonders to learn music, change the air, input navigation destinations or place calls. And you have the alternative to hold the voice button longer gain access to Siri with your paired smartphone.